All right, workout is complete. Just got that one done. Started off with some farmer's carries with a kettlebell, which is way harder than I thought it would be. Ended off with 50 swings and 50 single unders. I was gonna get those swings unbroken, but sometimes your dog just has other plans for you. What I wanted to talk about in this video is a huge goal for me, something I've wanted for a very, very long time, and I'm finally gonna start making moves to make it happen. So, my goal is to turn this building into a gym. So, I've got this barn in the back of my house. It's about the size of a single car garage, and I want to turn this into a home gym. This is something that I've wanted for a long time. Uh, I've ever, all grown up, I wanted to have a gym at my house. Um, just going to the gym was never my favorite thing. Always having to wait for power racks, move benches out of the way so you can deadlift. Now that I'm trying to do a little bit more Olympic lifting, you know, I need to practice quite a bit. So I take up a lot of space and I want something to be my own. Now, there's just one problem with turning this into a home gym. It's currently packed with stuff. We, we just have a lot of things stored in here. Uh, workbenches, lawnmower, patio furniture. A lot, of things are being, a lot of things are being stored until we can clean up our yard, clean up our deck a little bit and get things back out there. But this is gonna be turned into a home gym. This is gonna change the way that I work out. It's gonna be fantastic. Um, first step, we're gonna be installing some rubber mats down. We're gonna be doing the three quarter inch horse stall mats. So that's gonna be step number one, getting everything out and putting the floors in. I wanna make sure I do things right. I am going to be researching like crazy, finding different equipment, finding racks, bars, weights, everything. I've already put a ton of time and effort into looking into what will fit in here, what the best layout is, how to, um, how to maximize the space. I've got some really big plans coming up in the near future and this space is gonna be fantastic for that. So, I'm gonna be starting a playlist here on the channel. That playlist is going to be the progression of this barn gym, home gym, whatever you wanna call it. That's gonna be what this playlist is gonna be. So it's not gonna to happen tomorrow. It's not gonna happen in the next two months. This is probably gonna take quite a while. It's gonna be a constant progression of buying equipment, testing equipment, and probably putting up a little review on the channel. So expect this to be a chronicled playlist. That being said, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to show everyone what our plans are with this space, um, what equipment we're gonna be putting in here. And obviously, everyone has seen that I have a kettlebell. Hey, Nova. <laughs> I have a kettlebell and I actually got something really awesome today. I'm not ready to show that right quite yet, but it's really cool. I'm very excited that I was able to snatch this up today. Um, but that's going to be in a different video because it's a whole nother topic that I'm excited to show everybody. Um, so I'm starting off with my body weight. I've got a kettlebell. I have a jump rope. And I have my TRX straps, which will go in here. And I've got a surprise that I'm very excited for. So that's what this is starting off with. Obviously, I need bars, weights, racks. So if you have a home gym or if you've got equipment and you wanna recommend something, leave it in the comments below. I'm gonna read all of them. I wanna have awesome equipment in here. I want this to be a fun space to work out in for myself, family, and friends. So if you know a company or if you've used a rack or a barbell or plate, anything, 
please leave a comment below. Um, like I said, I've got a kettlebell from Kettlebell Kings. Uh, I'm going to be using that. They'll probably be the company I use to get the rest of my kettlebells when I plan on getting some more. But anything else, I'm still open for suggestion on. I haven't dropped any money on it yet. And if you're wondering, why do a home gym? Why spend all that money on a home gym when you said before you're at a gym that's very close to your house and it's 24-7? Well, let me tell you. One, it is 24-7 to go to the gym, but I still have to leave the house. I have to get up, change, and leave my house. Whereas this is less than 100 feet from my back door. So I can still be here. If we have people over, I can still be at the house. I never have to leave. I can stay at my house and work out. It's always been a dream of mine to have this going on. I love the gym I'm at. Um, it's fantastic, it's met all my needs. I used to be at a really big gym and uh, I was always waiting for equipment. It was always too busy and I could never get the full workout in or I had to change things. Now that I'm at the new gym, it's met my needs very, very well. It, it is 24 seven, it is fairly close to my home, so it's not that difficult for me to go. But having this in a barn has been my dream for a very long time. And so I'm making it become a reality. Jen is excited for it. I'm excited for it. So we're gonna get started on it. This is gonna be video number one of an untold amount of videos, but there's gonna be a lot of fun things to come. So stay tuned. Just in case you're wondering, or I need another reason to start a home gym, going from workouts to rest is gonna be way easier. <laughs> All right, guys, so keep up the good work. Until the next video, remember, we're all in progress. Have a great day.